New tonight, the district is releasing the grade DC results, and overall it's an A- minus for the city this past month. But the report includes a surprising grade for fire and emergency management services, which ended up with an A+. Plus. This despite the problems within the department that we've been reporting on. Mike Kinnean joins us from the Satellite Center with more on the grades. Mike? Morris, in recent months, you know Fire Chief Kenneth Ellerby and his department have come under fire because of delays in response times and with female cadets accusing male instructors of harassment. Also, union officials say critical staffing, like hiring paramedics, is not happening and that deteriorating fire equipment is not being replaced fast enough. Before the D.C. Council last week, an apologetic LRB admitted half the district's ambulances are not in service. But looking at the March grade D.C. report, you would think that everything is A-OK. -okay. In January, D.C. Fire and EMS received an A+. -plus. In February, it received an A. Then in March, it got another A+. -plus. At his biweekly press briefing, the mayor defended the report, saying it's not produced by his administration, but by an outside firm. And he says his staff does the best it can to get the word out about the program so the public can participate. We don't do this ourselves. New Brand Analytics is the one that uh, does the mining of the data in various social media. Uh, and then they do the analysis uh, of the data. So uh, they are analyzing the data that have been expressed through a variety of social media. And those are the results that they've concluded. Um, what I find interesting is that there are a lot of people out there who are dissatisfied. Apparently, they're not expressing it. The mayor also faced more questions about the embattled fire chief. The mayor says he still supports LRB. When asked if he had any concern about last week's council hearing or the limited number of operational district ambulances, the mayor said, quote, Deputy Mayor Paul Quander has spent an enormous amount of time working with the chief and FEMS to make sure we have full and complete information. The mayor also said his administration will continue to work to improve those conditions and to improve relationships among the firefighters and FEMS leadership. The mayor also pointed out that his proposed 2014 budget includes money for new FEMS equipment. Reporting live in the Satellite Center, Mike Kinney, News Channel 8.